Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. Thank you for all the inspiring comments you left on my healthy snack video and you said that you wanted more so today's video is exactly that. More healthy snacks based on the Mediterranean diet. We're gonna make some guacamole and instead of dipping fattening chips into it, we're going to serve it in these colorful red radicchio cups. So I have two avocados here that I've already chopped up. I'm going to add some salt. Some red onion. I chopped up some hot pepper, just a little bit. Give it a little kick, but I don't want to kill us. I like to add color to it, so I have a little bit of a tomato here, and it also adds some juice. Garlic, because what would guacamole be without garlic? At least the way I like it, anyway. And then we're going to squeeze on some lime juice. Traditional. I don't have any cilantro, so I'm just skipping that step. Sometimes I would put basil if I didn't have cilantro, but I'm kind of out of herbs at the moment, so we're just winging it. The lime adds a nice bright enough flavor that I don't think we'll miss the cilantro that much. So I think I'm gonna use probably three of these. Oh, I'll use them all. Okay, I'm just gonna stir this up. Guacamole is so easy. And there's nothing bad in here for you. It's a good source of healthy fat with all the avocado and all the other flavors together. Everything is just so good for you. That's why it's a shame usually to eat it with fattening salty chips because then you're turning a snack, a healthy snack, into a fattening snack. But this way, I think it'll be fun to serve this in radicchio cups. You can just grab a little radicchio taco and have a bite. Doesn't that look good? Oh, I can't wait to eat this. <laughs> Now I'm making a white bean mixture that I would normally put onto an Italian bread crostini, but instead we're going to use as a dip and we're going to use some vegetable crudite to make it healthier. So I chopped up a garlic clove here. I have a can of white cannellini beans, which I've rinsed and drained in here already. I have a mixture here of salt, pepper, and red pepper flakes. Just sprinkle that around. A little bit of olive oil. So we're gonna put a little olive oil on afterwards as well. We're just gonna blitz this together. to make a healthy alternative to a milkshake. So in the blender here, we have a frozen banana that I've just sliced up and frozen overnight. I'm gonna add a little bit of cinnamon, a tiny splash of vanilla extract, and we have macadamia nut milk. And we're gonna blend this together. Now we're going to pour it into our glasses. Yeah. 
I have a healthy banana milkshake. Cheers. <laughs> And now we're making a nice light alternative to soda pop. So I have some watermelon balls that I've put in these glasses and see the juice that comes out of the watermelon as well. I'm gonna add some of that. Be a nice fruit infusion. I'm going to squeeze in some lime juice into each of these. For a little zip. And then we have Italian sparkling mineral water. I like to serve it in wine glasses because it looks pretty. And the watermelon gives it a beautiful color. We're going to garnish it with a little lime. <laughs> So how does that look? Mm. Hope you enjoyed this video and I hope you tried the snacks for yourself and let me know if you do. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye! <laughs>